name is Eden Sadon. I'm a textile designer from Tel Aviv, Israel. My story begins exactly a year ago, when I came across on an internet commercial about a 3D pen manufactured by a company called 3 Doodler, showing a girl sitting in a living room and drawing a three-dimensional model of the Eiffel Tower. I was very excited by the possibility of drawing a three-dimensional structure made of yarn using a 3D drawing pen. During my textile design studies at Chanka College of Design in Tel Aviv, I learned how to produce fabric structures made of yarns using various techniques, such as weaving, knitting, and flatting. The simple production of a 3D structure demonstrated by the little girl in that commercial appealed to me. I ordered that pen and started experimenting with it. The pen has a rather simple mechanism. It is an electrical device that has to be connected to the socket on the wall. It is an inlet for introducing a polymer rod, a driver that moves the rod forward in two possible speeds, and an extruder head that heats and melts the polymer rod and discharges the melted material. The extruder head is replaceable to allow different extrusion sizes. First, I experimented with polymers called PLA and ABS which are known in the field of 3D printing. I wanted to make a bra, which is a small article of clothing that has to fulfill functionality, maintain shape and present some flexibility. I discovered that these materials were very rigid and fragile. Then, I moved to another kind of polymer offered by the producer of the pen, called Flexi, which is TPU that turned out to have the qualities I was looking for. It was strong, flexible and environmental friendly. The use of Flexi allowed me to produce surfaces having textile qualities, like draping, movement, flexibility and lightness, by drawing a 3D structure of varying densities. These discoveries were very exciting. I realized that the techniques I obtained during my studies, such as lace knitting, embroidery and jacquard weaving, may all be implemented using the 3D pen. As it turned out, the process of making my designs produced no waste, as the extruder material instantly became part of the design. The notion of a machine that upgrades human skills and yet allows maintaining a unique personal handwriting in a world where technology and automation replace human labor excites me as a designer. I made a collection of delicate feminine lace garments using a single tool, the 3D pen, single material, flexi, and single color, black. I decided to work that way in order to emphasize the many capabilities of the 3D pen. In my work, I was inspired by the rich tapestry drawing of William Morris, the unconventional architectural buildings of Frank Gehry, paper and bamboo sculptures by Ai Weiwei, body sketches by Oskar Schlemmer, and African tribal body painting. I think that the novelty of my designs comes from the fact that the 3D drawing makes the fabric itself. There are no stitches and the garment takes the body shape during the process of the drawing and is custom made for a specific person without the use of a layout. I live in Israel, which is a country with a strong high-tech sense. In my work, I try to interweave between new technologies and old textile traditions. Thank you.